What up, day 92, dude? 92? Yeah, that's what year you were born, right? I didn't got up to 92. I was like, good job, dude. <laughs> You're a poet and don't know it. <laughs> um, we just finished up with some warm ups, did some abs and some forearms, got them good and pumped, um, and now we're gonna hop into some biceps. We're gonna, we typically we start with chin ups, but this place is packed. So to mix it up and just so I don't, you know, my heart rate doesn't doesn't drop any more than it already has. We're just gonna start with uh, some preacher curls. Uh, awesome machine, awesome machine. We got a 45 and a 25 on. Probably, what do you think, dude? Like five sets? Pretty heavy, five pretty heavy sets. So five sets. Yeah, that's pretty heavy. Good. All right. Well, and then on day 100, Justin's gonna be buying a motorcycle. So <laughs> comment down below if you want to tag along. A bobber that. bike, dude. I could rock that. You imagine this blown in the wind? Thank you guys so much for being here. Let's go. Four more sets. All right, Cody ain't gonna like this, but I'm gonna mix things up today. You wanna hear? I'm leaving this on until the posing room. I'm gonna do it. I want to do a sick arm reveal after I'm done. So it's a nice shirt, though. It's not a nice shirt. I've only had it for ever. Um, you look better without it. So I just take all my clothes off. Well, I think that's <laughs> Biceps are getting. I'm gonna make them wait to see it though. Let's go. What's up, dude? All right, one more set. We're gonna do a drop set on this one. All right, last set. We'll do a drop set. 
Do what? Huh? All right, thanks. <laughs> thanks, dog. The peptides are kicking in, man. The, the trend is kicking in right now. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go. Peptides. They don't know. It's oral. It's. What do you say? What do you? I appreciate you, buddy. The biggest guy in here just told me I'm big. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go cry real quick. Right, let's go. My music stopped playing. I need you to come touch my AirPod. <laughs> Just tap it twice. With my nose or what? <laughs> With your tongue. <laughs> hurry, hurry. There you go. Wait. There you go. Oh. Thanks, sir. Oh my god. Whew. Let's go do something else. Alright, let's do some Bayesian hammer curls. I, we talked about doing dumbbells, and hear me out. This is why, let me pitch this to you. So these are better with your elbows flared out because when your elbows out are, are like this, and you come up, you're taking your front delt entirely out of it. With dumbbells, you can't do it with dumbbells because you'd be clanging against each other. And if you stand like this, you'll, you'll hit your brachialis in your forearm, but there's a chance as you start to get fatigued, you'll start to get a lot of your front delt into it as well. This is just pure isolation right here. So screw the dumbbells. I'm gonna keep doing this. I'll do this twice a week until my arms are just ginormous. I just yelled, ho! Oh! So All right. Okay. Two more sets. Oh, is it already recording? Is it already recording? That's it. What do you want to do next, bro? You pick preacher curls. This is your arm day. What do you want to do next? What do you want to fucking do next? Dumbbells. Dumbbell, alternating dumbbell curls? Dumbbell curls, dog. Heavy or light or what? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Stop, 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 stop. <laughs> stupid. So stupid. I should have said, how's the weather up there? But... <laughs> All right, let's go. 45 pounds. Oh, let's see how many I can do. Too heavy. Let's uh, let's do let's do forties uh, instead. All right, thirty fives. Mm. 
<laughs> All right, two more sets. triceps time now so we're doing some overhead easy bar extensions focus on the long head stretch um, gonna do like four sets yeah four sets of these <sighs> yeah you know you know what yeah I was gonna go on a ramp no let's go I was gonna talk about gym bros bragging on gym bros like no I was just saying like you don't know how far a compliment dude this biggest guy in here just said that we were looking good like I'm like on cloud nine like don't be afraid to like brag on your gym bros or people at the gym you know gas them up that was the best bicep lift we've had in months it's so, so good god damn look how big i am <laughs> yeah just take it just take it we're going to do more weight. That was a warm up. <laughs> Look at big strong man. That's my new thumbnail, Cody. That's my thumbnail. <laughs> Say cheese. All right. I got 80 pounds now. You good? You good? That's, this is big boy weight, dog. Let's go. Freddie Dredd is playing right now. Oh, I'm about to go get 100, dude. Look at that. Thanks, dude. Woo. All right, now let's do some push down, some heavy, full stack, just as many as I can. Let's do like four sets of this, or after three we feel good, maybe uh, do a drop set or something. We're gonna get 20 inch arms, dude. He's listening to music. I'm gonna get 20 inch arms, naturally too. <laughs> there we go. Let's do three more like that. Or two more. Full stack. Whoop, whoop. I'm stronger than Cody. Haha. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no. Alright, let's go. Round two. No, you're good, you're good. I should have paid. That's not not your job.
All right, we're gonna do rope extensions now. I got two of them, which is gonna allow me to go deeper in the squeeze, the contraction back here. Starting right here, and I'm trying to finish in behind my body like this, really squeezing the lateral head and the long head. So, like this. Like that. Let's do three more sets. Okay. I'm done. See you in the studio. Huh? Says it just drops at Friday. Drop drops at Friday. Yeah. Yeah. Good work, dog. See you in the studio. Arm day's done. Arm day, best day, right? Yeah. All right, Pumperville, y'all been waiting. This, this sure gave me, pa dude, today was like, that was a good arm day. That was the best one we've had in a while. The biceps are cooked, man. But yeah, the mullet and the, the compliment from the biggest dude here and the pump cover gave me powers. A little nipple hanging out for you guys. Side tricep. That's it, one of these. There it is. All right, see in the truck. All right. <laughs> measurement, uh, what's the uh, measurement reveal? Let's see, I might need your help, dog. <laughs> Here. <laughs> Here, I'm gonna let Cody do it. What's up, fam? All right, so I'm not cheating either. You want it so the camera can see? Yeah. All right. Oh, I got bigger, guys. Yeah, see, you should have done that from the get-go. Look at that. Dude, 17 and a half. You see that? Oh. I told you, 17 and a half. Let's go. All right, I'll see you in the truck now. Arm day's done. I'm beat up, man. To be honest, I did not sleep that long last night. So I'm very thankful for caffeine, but it's catching up to me, man. As soon as I was walking out, I'm like, I probably slept like four hours. No joke. That's okay. It was still an awesome day. But if I keep doing that every day, I'm not going to be able to recover. And not. there's no way I'm going to be intense every day like that. So we're in the pump cover. I mean, that was a tease, but... Um, I liked it, dude. I like I just the uh, the anticipation of what my arms looked like when I was done. That was fun. Seventeen and a half. Suck it. Suck it. That's pretty good. That's above average, right? I know it's relative to like body type and stuff, but I got some fat. And as I lose fat, I'm probably gonna shrink a little bit. Dude, my hair is. I'm sweaty. Um, but yeah, that was one of the best arm days I've had since vlogging. It was great. It was great. It's just, 
that's the thing, man. It's nice to be consistent, but variety's good. It's good for the soul and stuff, you know. So that was a, a very unique arm day. We've never started with preacher curls first, but I loved I loved that. I loved it a lot. We wanted to do chin ups, but it was packed. Every squat rack was taken. The assisted pull up machine was taken. So I, I can't sit around and wait, you know. But yeah, something I need to. You just ran a stop sign, dude. People can't drive. Maybe I'm the problem, right? There's been a lot of. <laughs> that accident, dude, I was parked, bro. I was parked. I wasn't even moving. Um, but anyway, I'm beat up, man. I'm beat up. It was an awesome day. Uh, definitely got better. I love the little the bicep check. I can touch now, but right after the dumbbell curls, I couldn't even touch my my shoulders. So that's always good. I, that's not an indication of growth or anything. It's just it's just fun. Knowing that they're you know pumped up so much you can't even touch your your front delt. That's pretty sick. But um, yeah, I'm gonna go rest. I got not a lot of work to do today, thankfully. Um, so and then you know. Tomorrow's deadlift day. It's been a while since I put out a deadlift video, ain't it? Um, let's throw on, let's just see how we feel. It might be, uh, I'm not done deadlifts in a few weeks, just to be honest. So, well, it's been four weeks, because I didn't do it at all in Colorado. Um, let's just see how we feel, right? Last time we did a five by six, we did 365. I'm confident I can still do that. I don't know if I'll go right into 370, um, you know what I mean? Not, I'm not trying to wimp out or anything. I'm going to be intense. If, if 365, the first set feels good, I'll, I'll keep doing it. But I don't know. Let's just, let's just see. My deadlift is just, uh, I don't know. It's the best compound for overall, like strength development, but you can mess your stuff up too, dude. Like your posterior chain, like there's so much that can go wrong. Like four weeks, I'd consider myself a little cold. So just ease into it, you know, and then maybe go ham the following week, but, um, just get my body used to that heavy weight again, so, anyway, that's, that's kind of what I'm thinking about for tomorrow, we're gonna stop and get a donut, I don't know what kind I get, the last two have fumbled, but, I don't know, you can't, I mean, is there such thing as a bad donut, they just weren't as good as the other ones, so, got a little too creative, maybe I'll just get a plain glazed one, just leave it at that, simple, just like cookies, man, like, I know crumble is, like, a big thing, and, you know, there's a place here called Crave, but, uh, like, simple's better. Like, give me, like, an old, just a plain old chocolate chip or, like, a sugar cookie. Dude, my eyes are so, I can see how tired my eyes are. But just give me, like, a plain old, like, chocolate chip or sugar cookie. Every, dude, once in a while, you know, like, crumble's got that, that strawberry cheesecake one, which is pretty good, but I don't know. It's just... Just like that. You don't have to get, you know, simple is sometimes better. So I'm not much on like the bacon jalapeno chocolate covered donuts. I just, I mean, I love all those things and I'm sure it's good, but just give me something plain, you know? But anyway, much love. Uh, happy day 92, 92. Yeah, 92. So tomorrow would be three months, man. That's crazy. Almost at day 100 already. So we're getting close to being a third of the way done with the year mark. I'm really excited to, uh, I figured about halfway in, I'll start working on like the year transformation video, which isn't a true year transformation. It's just a, a year vlogging transformation, right? Because I was working out seven months, or si sorry, six months before I started the vlog. Um, and, you know, I've not recorded every single day, right? Like the rest days count and stuff too. So, but you know, I started vlogging, I think it was December 22nd of last year. And, um, duh, cause it's only been a couple months. Anyway, um, by the time I'm, I'm to 365 videos, it's going to be like March or something. It's going to be like almost a year from now, but I don't know. I'm, I'm, I'm fine with it. I love it. I love the daily grind. I love inspiring you guys. Um, I like learning as I go and you guys keep me intense and it's just a fun little hobby, man. You know, I'm not trying to blow up on YouTube or anything. 
I'm financially supported with, with my own career, it's just fun, man. It's just, you know, there's a lot worse hobbies I could be getting into. But I do it because you guys keep me intense and accountable. And I put my diet on there because I know if I don't track my calories and stuff, and I'm not losing weight, you know what I mean? Like, I have to be consistent. And you guys, I, I would still be consistent, but not to, to the degree I am with, with you guys watching. You know, you know what I mean? Does that make sense? So, I love y'all. Y'all changed my life, man. Changed my life. I'm going to post some pictures, dude. I found some last night that are going to blow your mind. That are going to absolutely blow your mind. Changed a lot. <laughs> I've actually looked, I look 10 years younger. <laughs> I found one, man. Uh, I found a picture from 2019. And, uh, you know, my oldest was a year old. And I stopped. I was working out, you know, pretty vigorously for years up until he, he was born. And just some stuff happened. And uh, anyway, pretty much I just got lazy, right? I just, I don't know, made too many excuses. And then, you know, before you know it, I just I just stopped going. And uh, the, the weight gain came pretty rapid. But, yeah, 2019, I was about 240 pounds just no no man you got to see like i feel like i have pretty nice calves that non-existent just it was i mean it's pretty embarrassing I, I, you know what i'll post it right now I, you know i'm not going to tease y'all make y'all wait i'll post it right now but ain't that crazy um but yeah so what i'm getting at you guys changed my life i'm the best version of myself and uh i'm not trying to be corny but you know, you don't have to go to the gym and be active to be happy, but, I mean, this has been great for my mental health. Um, you know, it's great for the confidence, you know. It just, it's just nice, man. It's just, it just, it feels nice, you know. It feels nice to know that, you know, I'm making progressions. I'm getting really strong. I'm starting to see some abs. It's, you know, I've not seen my abs in, like, eight years, dude. It's been crazy. Or, no, six years, but... Anyway, I'm talking about nonsense. Uh, like always, you know, I'm memeing myself. I'm gonna go home, eat some rice, eat some chicken. Well, I'm sorry, I always mess that up. I'm gonna. This is what I do when I go home. All right, I don't know why I say that. Well, the first thing I do when I go home is take a protein shake with five grams of creatine. You don't need more than five grams of creatine, right? I I know there's people that say it's bad on your kidneys if you take more. Probably. If you happen to take seven, don't, like, lose sleep over it. Like, you're fine. So take five grams of creatine monohydrate with 64 grams or two scoops of whey isolate. And then um, then I'll have a bowl of rice with it. Jasmine rice. I can eat jasmine rice. I mean, I do. I've, I've been eating jasmine rice every day for, like, two months. I love it. It's so good. But uh, And then I'll wait an hour and a half or two hours. Look at the time two hours and then not not particular reason I just like keeping food going in my system and I don't I'm bouncing around I'm not trying to I'm sorry but I don't like to eat more than 50 grams of protein um, per meal so that's why I spread them out like I wouldn't worry so much if I had to you know if I could fit it on one meal I would but I'm, I'm and I don't know enough to talk about it I'm partially paranoid that if I sit down and have 100 grams of protein, how much am I really, you know, digest? How much am I really absorbing? Or what's the benefit of that? You know, I just feel like, I don't know, I'm probably a little too paranoid. I like to spread it out. And dude, I'm not, I'm just a gym bro. I'm not a, a like a like a science bro or anything. I'm just a gym bro. I like spreading it out, and it's been working. I mean, why why change things if they're working, right? But anyway, two hours I'll have you know 50 grams of protein via chicken breast and then I'll wait another two hours and I'll have dinner and some more carbs to kind of help me stay full at night time but yeah anyway I love you guys so much I'll see you guys tomorrow for deadlift have a good day bye